The Pindad AM-1, an advanced assault rifle developed by Indonesia's PT Pindad, has been making waves on the international stage since its introduction in 2022. Known for its lightweight design and modern features, the AM-1 has attracted widespread interest, particularly due to its resemblance to the M4 and AR-15 carbines, which are favored globally for their versatility and ease of use. Replacing the older Pindad SS-2 model, the AM-1 is now the standard-issue weapon for the Indonesian National Armed Forces, TNI. Before its adoption, the rifle underwent rigorous testing to ensure that it met the high-performance standards demanded by military personnel. Indonesian officials, including elite units such as Kopassus, have praised its structural durability, accuracy, and ergonomic design, reinforcing its role as a key asset for the nation's defense forces. During a public demonstration at Lapangan Siling Monas in Jakarta on October 2, 2024, PT Pindad CEO, Abraham Mose, expressed pride in the AM-1's growing international demand. We have received inquiries from several countries, including the United States, due to its simplicity and reliability. ASEAN countries have also shown interest, Mose remarked. His comments reflect the rifle's broad appeal from Southeast Asia to North America. The AM-1 has been prominently displayed at global defense exhibitions, generating significant interest from foreign markets. Notably, the rifle was showcased at the Asian Defense, Security and Crisis Management Exhibition and Conference, ADAS 2024, in the Philippines. Organized by the Philippine Department of National Defense, ADAS 2024 highlighted the AM-1 specifications, including its 5.56 by 45mm NATO caliber, 14.5-inch barrel, and adjustable telescopic stock, which offers flexibility for various tactical environments. Measuring 881 mm when fully extended and 797 mm in its compact form, the rifle is built to cater to both close-quarters combat and longer-range engagements. In addition to defense exhibitions, interest from the United States has spurred discussions of potential export opportunities, further strengthening PT Pindad's global reputation. ASEAN nations are also exploring partnerships for acquiring the rifle, driven by its proven performance in military trials. Before its introduction to the market, the AM-1 underwent extensive field testing. Indonesia's Kopassus unit evaluated the rifle's accuracy at ranges of 100, 200, 300, and 400 meters. The ASEAN Army's Rifle Meet ARM, team also verified its precision and effectiveness, confirming that the rifle meets stringent operational requirements for combat situations. In addition to its performance capabilities, the rifle has won praise for its simplicity, which ensures that soldiers can quickly adapt to using it under stressful conditions. Indonesian military leaders, including the commander of Kopassus and the commander of the Marine Corps, were actively involved in the testing process, further solidifying its position within the ranks of the TNI. With the AM-1, PT Pindad aims to strengthen Indonesia's defense capabilities while also contributing to national pride. Supported by experienced staff and state-of-the-art production facilities, PT Pindad is positioning the AM-1 as a high-quality, reliable weapon not just for Indonesia but for international defense markets as well. As foreign interest in the rifle continues to grow, PT Pindad is exploring export opportunities that could extend the rifle's reach beyond Southeast Asia. The AM-1's combination of advanced design, battlefield proven reliability, and versatile performance makes it a strong contender in the competitive global arms market. In conclusion, the Pindad AM-1 represents a major leap forward for Indonesia's defense manufacturing industry, capturing the attention of global military forces. Its growing popularity signals a bright future for PT Pindad, as the company strives to expand its presence on the world stage while contributing to Indonesia's defense modernization efforts.